The great G.K. Chesterton told us that a moral standard must remain the same, otherwise it is not really a standard. This is one of the great comments from about 100 years ago that tells us that morality is something that is unchanging. Not only is it consistent across all of the world's great religions and humanities, but it's also consistent across time. Yeah. And that it is always good to be honest instead of being a liar. It is always good to be fair and just rather than to be unjust. It is always best to be heroic in our action rather than being cowardice in our action. And this is what Chesterton was talking about and that this standard must remain the same. The Nietzschean worldview, on the other hand, is something that backs away from this, that it wants everything to be conforming to that which we would internally desire to be. Meaning it wants us to set up on our own to be the determinant of our own hierarchical system in that we would be the determinants of the ethics, that the ethics would be able to be changing and be able to be conforming to our desires. This is not the truth about ethics. And within our own ethical framework, we must realize that we ourselves are responsible to a higher conforming governing over our actions. The types of actions where we are called, for instance, whenever we see a man's life put in peril, we see him maybe being be beaten up, that we are given two options. The first is to run in and try to save him, and the second option for self-preservation. These two options are in conflict. In fact, the second self-preservation is the one that we most want to do. But this first option, this option that we would run in and save the individual, put our own selves at peril, the more heroic of the two options, this is what we should do. What we want to do and what we should do are diametrically opposed. And so why do we know that the right thing to do is to do the heroic thing and not the cowardice thing? It's because we have something above it judging those two things that the Nietzschean worldview does not want to be able to assent to. It wants to back off from that, provide a relativistic type of worldview. And this is why as leaders, we must be standing on a firm foundation that is based on moral integrity, leadership, and the heroic underpinning of what we believe to be truth. You know, I think it was John F. Kennedy that made the comment that the greatest possible evil is that whenever we see a moral injustice that we do not stand up against it, that we do not fight against it, that this is the greatest moral tragedy. This is the greatest evil that leaders do not stand up and fight against injustice and a breaking of the moral law. And so we, my friends, must adhere to this as leaders.